Hi, I'm Shelley, and today I'm going to introduce you to Clarius OB AI. We are on a mission to make fetal biometry measurements easily achievable for all caregivers, regardless of their level of ultrasound experience. And today I have a second trimester pregnancy, and I'm going to show you how the AI makes fetal biometry measurements really easy. So I'm going to start off at the fetal head, and we'll get an image at the level of the head, and then I'm going to activate the AI by selecting the OB option, and this indicates uh, second or third trimester measurements. So right away, you'll see that the AI has recognized this as the fetal head. I can go in and adjust the opacity of that mask if I like a brighter mask. And then if we scan through the head and I go too low at the base of the skull, the mask disappears. So this indicates that I'm not at the right level to measure the head, same as if I'm up too high. So if we get a nice image, I can freeze it, and the AI is going to place the calipers for me. So these are both indicating a gestational age of 19 weeks and five days, which corresponds well to the estimated due date based on the first ultrasound. So I'm gonna take that image, and then we'll move on to the abdomen. So we're gonna slide down to the abdominal level, and the AI has recognized that we're looking at an axial slice through the abdomen. And again, if I freeze the image, the calipers are going to be placed, and they're accurately placed here. If for some reason they weren't, I always have the option of adjusting my calipers after the fact. And again, we're getting a gestational age of 20 weeks and two days, which is very accurate. So we'll take that image, and next we'll slide down to the femur. And as soon as the AI sees the femur, it places that mask, but it also has two little colored ends. It's important that both of those ends are highlighted because that's where the AI is going to place the calipers. So again, once I freeze, calipers will be placed, accurate measurement, and we can take an image. Now at this point, once our images are all done, we can go back into the report page, and this is where I can access the ultrasound gestational age, the estimated fetal weight, and all of my measurements and images. We can end our exam, and all of those images and numbers will be in the report.